Hey guys, it's Haig here, and this is video 2 on how to completely back up a computer. In video 1, we showed you how to create a system repair CD, and in this video, we're going to show you how to create a recovery partition. So in video 3, you're going to be able to uh, use that recovery partition to completely back up your operating system and, and all your files, your sentence, and every document and music in case your computer were to crash you know and go on bootable so you have a complete image backup of it so in this video we're gonna go over on how to create up the partition alright and to create a partition before we do that we want to know how much used used space we have on our hard drive right now and it's easy to uh, find that out if you click on your uh, start menu and you go into your computer you locate local disk C right click and when you go down to the properties it should show you how much used space you have on the hard drive and in my case I got 75 gigs of used space and I have 500 gigabytes of free space so in my case I'm going to be creating an 80 gigabyte partition so what I would do is I'll be creating a, a partition which is bigger than 75 gigabytes basically so to do that I also want to find out what 80 gigabytes is in, mili in megabytes kind of hard to explain but what so for my case I'm gonna open up a browser and I'm gonna write 80 GB to MB so I get the number and I need to copy this number down because in the next step you're gonna see why I need that number once I right click on that, copy it, exit out of that, I'm gonna we're gonna now create up the partition. To create a partition up, we're gonna click on start. We're gonna go into computer, right click actually, right click on computer, go to manage. When the computer management window opens up, click disk management. Locate the C drive, right click and click shrink volume and let that load and this is going to attempt to shrink the volume of the C drive Alright, so once that's done, we want to put in the amount of space in megabytes because we want to make this, in my case, this partition has to be bigger than the use space of the C drive, so I have to go 80 gigs. I went to Google and I know that the number that I need to put in is this, 800000, which will be roughly, actually I'm going to make it even bigger, I'm going to give it some more space I'm going to put 5000 zero, zero, zero in here just to give it some more space sorry I can't do that I just want a bit more than 80 gigs it's always good to make the partition slightly bigger than that anyways anyway but uh you get the point I need to make it bigger than what's actually my use space of my C drive and click shrink and what that's going to do is it's going to create us a partition that's over 80 gigs just wait for a moment here alright so I've got 70 oh well at least it's over 75 gigs which is already good enough alright so what I want to do is I'm going to see where it says unallocated here. I'm going to right click, new simple volume, next, click next, and I'm going to assign a drive letter for this partition. I'm going to call it R. It doesn't matter what drive letter you assign it to, just click next. And when you go down to here where it says volume label, call it recovery. Click next click finish and now we basically created ourselves a nice partition here and it's called recovery R so if you've done this com 
this right, if you go back into your start menu and you go into computer here, you should see you have a, re a recovery hard drive or and the drive letters are all right so now we've created a partition which is bigger than the actual C drive and uh, in the next video we're going to be using this partition to completely back up our entire operating system onto here okay so uh, in video free we're going to go over that so thanks for watching video two, and remember to comment right and subscribe